Hello, it's Oswald again, and today um, we're going to see my new Rubik's Cube solver. This one's much better than the old one, but it still works in this with the same principle. One motor controls a claw, one motor controls a color sensor, one motor controls a turntable. However, the new one doesn't require that the cube be tilted, and it also generates a correct solution every time, unlike the old one, which messed up sometimes. So, here we have a scrambled cube. I'm just going to scramble it a little more. Damn, cubes take so long to scramble. Okay. Here, fully scrambled cube. Now, what we're going to do is simply, we're going to put the cube in the robot. And... They're always going to solve it. Simple as that. So, we're going to press the button and let it, it's going to do a hardware initialization. Now, we give it a cube. It's going to scan the cube. As you can see, the color sensor moves back and forth and scans the cube while that arm turns the cube. Now, it's going to calculate a solution. And now it's going to solve the cube. This is going to take a long time, so if you don't want to let it wait, and you just want to see it solve the solve the, the, the cube solve, just skip to like the last few minutes of the video, and you'll see a solve cube. No, it's fine. And it solved it. Woo! It's a blink screen to show that the cubes are fully solved. And here, a fully solved cube. Well, that's it. Hope you enjoyed this video, and see ya.